welcome or I should say willkommen to the Centre Hotel Kaiserhof in Naumburg in Saxony Anhalt in Germany it's absolutely roasting it's about 32 degrees outside and this room has no air conditioning and I'm baking hot so I need to begin my review by expressing that because that's how I feel oh, there's no air conditioning but hopefully I can make the window open properly yes after a slight struggle here's a Juliet balcony Romeo Romeo give me some cold air so Naumburg Hauptbahnhof railway station is literally there and this is a one minute walk from the station <sighs> crikey Germany gets so hot in summer and Germans will say, no, no, it never gets so hot in summer. But trust me, it does. Oh, I am melting. Right. So upon getting into the room on the right hand side, we have a mirror, which reveals the rest of the room. I'm filming on a Hero 6, incidentally. This is just a little, oh, wow, it's super wide. Um, little experiment, just trying it out, see how it goes. So, I've got two beds and I'm, I'm obviously only on my own uh, incidentally the room has cost 50 pounds and 29 pence for one night on a bed and breakfast basis which I don't think is too bad to be quite honest I think it's reasonable it would have been even more reasonable if it had air conditioning up there and I would have paid another 30 euros for that but never mind I'll stop going on about that now right so so the beds are, they're really small, they're like children's beds. I mean, they're too small, they're so low down. I, I'm, I'm quite unenthused by them, although I will push them together to make a, a double, obviously. If I can, will they move? I don't know if they'll move, actually. Oh, no, they will, they're on wheels. I'll do that later. On either side of the beds... There is a plug socket, which is good, we like. But in between them, there is no bedside table. Although there is one on either side. There's a chair for sitting down. What else do you use a chair for? Standing on to change the ceiling light bulb? No, because there aren't any. Actually, where are the lights? Oh, there's a light there, and there's a light there. And there's one in the hallway, but that's about it. There's a, a wardrobe luggage storage area thing here. Four coat hangers and storage space below. A little desk area and another chair. And then there's a old school square Nokia TV with a variety of different channels. And then draw, and that's a false draw, that doesn't do anything. Some shelving space. There's not a lot to report, really. It's got quite a budget hotel feel. It seems quite old as well. Um, I mean, if you look at the wallpaper, it's the old wood chip affair. Oh. There's a fly. Perils of having the window open, but it's either roast or fly. What do you do? Bathroom, beginnings of the hairdryer for those people who wish to preen their before. It's a star mix. I haven't seen a star mix for a while. Um, hand pump soap, tissues, blah, 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 blah. And the toilet is in a separate room, which also houses the shower. It's got a slight pungent odour, sulfury. Not the best, but okay. Um, now in here, 
Your shower is uh, another cubicle like I've just had before. Sorry, you might not have seen my last review, but this is a one slight step up, just a small one, which is good. But it's not the dreaded shower bath, which is even better. Now the bath, the, the uh, this room is the coolest part of the actual room itself, <laughs> believe it or not, and also quite noisy. Oh dear! So there's not a lot more I can add at this point in time. I'm going to uh, have a wander around uh, Naumburg today, do a bit of footage and I will try and get a bit more film around the hotel. There's not a lot to film, mind. I'll film reception, bar and breakfast buffet tomorrow, but that'll be about it. But from Roast in Naumburg, I'll feed us in for now. is an ANS. It says it holds eight. I don't believe them. They always overestimate lifts, don't they? <laughs> 